It fascinates me that so many podcasts don't have a call to action that turns their listeners into leads. At the point that someone has just listened to a podcast, they are red hot. They absolutely want to do business with you. They want to talk to you. They're excited about all the content, something to do. If you don't give them something to do, what are they going to do? They're going to listen to the next podcast. At the end of every podcast and and in the middle and at the beginning, you should encourage people to take an online quiz or a scorecard that helps them to get the most from that podcast. Now, what do I mean by that? So I created something called the Key Person of Influence Scorecard. I was invited onto hundreds of podcasts to talk about the idea of becoming a key person of influence. And what we did is we set up a Key Person of Influence Scorecard so people could answer 40 questions to find out what they need to implement in order to become a key person of influence, which was the topic of those podcasts. So what that did is it turned the listeners into leads. As soon as they listened to that podcast, they got the link to the key person of influence scorecard, they took the scorecard, and that allowed us to talk to them and engage with them and to further the relationship. I really want you to try this, and we've created some templates that are perfect for turning listeners into leads. They're perfect for accompanying any podcast. The templates are ready to go. You fill in the blanks. It probably takes 20 or 30 minutes to set one up. Then you've got a tool or a mechanism for creating engagement with your listeners and turning them into leads, ultimately sales.